And there we go again there, lads. BBPN and guests there. Blood Bowl once again so bizarre. It is bloody awful here on Sunday. Bloody awful Sunday. So, once again here, final eight, match number two tonight here. Yeah, let's see what goes crazy today. Sounds like you're gonna have an interesting day there. It's an interesting day indeed. Oh, let's get this ready here. Oh, God, I think I'm gonna need more alcohol for this one. All right, so let's take a look at what we got here. Oh, this is what we've been looking forward to here. Orcs versus Luggage. Now, you've watched both these firms as they've progressed here. Both their solid coaches the hell way there. Luggage. This is the team that utterly, totally fucked their opponent very nicely. They did a great job of it there. They played solid, they played sharp, they never gave up, and they got a well-deserved result. Not gonna lie, they got a very well-deserved result. They got a solid win there versus their... <coughs> ah, 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 corpse. Ah. Yeah, pretty much. Meanwhile, on the other side here, well... For once, the Orcs might be in a bit of trouble. Well, maybe. Maybe not. We will see how the Orcs do it here. Black Gulf booty smashes. They got here, but as they would admit, they got hurt getting here. So it's been quite the beating, but they're here. Final eight, and they know there is no tomorrow. So they have spent, like, absolutely no tomorrow. Because if they don't win, there isn't any. And they have brought in not just good old Bomber Driver Snot, but they've also brought in Ripper. There we go, solid it, and the Copperheads of all things, they're going to actually go and get the reroll for this time. Shenanigans! 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 Well, maybe it is shenanigans. Let's take a look there. As you can see, he had the fame, so not really shenanigans here. Now the Orcs get right to work. They commence the beating. So you can see here the Orcs. It's an interesting choice, considering they've got no troll, but they've brought Ripper in just for this game. Now remember, Ripper does not have really stupid, has grab, and is strength six. However, that's his highlights. He has all kinds of problems. Stand firm! Well, he likes to actually move over here just to get his piss on. And meanwhile, more Morks moving in here. Mork, Mork, Ork, Ork, Grok, Grok. And there we go. Solid pow. He's going to try and get himself one of these little Gucci handbags. And still nothing. Rock, let's get out of here. Well, Ripper, good news is because he doesn't have the really stupid, you don't have to make the roll. That is why Ripper. Fun fact, he is the subject of a head transplant. True story. It worked successfully, so the head transplant has done miracles for them. It's amazing what you can do with modern medicine these days. Anyway, here we go. Orcs on their way. And they're merely getting started. Oh, you gonna pay for that? And there it is. A solid KO, lads. A solid KO. The Orcs have already got the first removal of the day. Doing it down and dirty. And yeah, the Orc coach is loving it. Luggage. Well... There were all your blodge sauruses there, so absolutely 100% was worth it. Quick little review. It's just extra booze the orcs have got, so their viewers, nope, they've got, you know, potentially one or two reserves. They are facing a potential ejection later on with Bomber, who they've kept benched right now, and that's not a bad idea. Oh! 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 That is an enormous failure. One die absolutely buggies it. Down he goes. The crowd goes absolutely wild. He apothecaries it. I was devastating. Oh, God. The luggage are suddenly out. Now another play. Another source is out of this game. 
But the Apothecary does come through. He could not, and you can see, he's just barely hurt. He could not risk that player staying out, being down two Sauruses, potentially this early in the game here. And the Orcs slam the wall as hard as they can. Full speed ahead. They taste blood! And they are definitely trying to prove something. They are tasting that final four. Oh, they, uh, 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 it, it, they're soaking in it, they hope. Soaking in blood! Well, they can only help, lads. Don't count your touchdowns before they're hatched here. This is an enormous gamble here. Just a single blitzer. He's got block. But it's not really ball security, is it, there, when you've seen how this firm has played. And I do believe he has solidly seen. And Ripper goes down. What? No! What? No! No! Ah, no! Ah! Thanks, Ripper. Thanks for being not worth the money you're on. Yeah, and there's the pylon. Is he dead now? Well, he's tried, but all of a sudden the orc entire right flank collapses by a ripper going down. Remember, one in nine is, or even one in 27. That's his ballast, and down he went. He might not like, get up for a while. Meanwhile, quick little stun here, and suddenly we're back in business. Now, remember, he does have pro on the crooks there. And he charges in. I told you! I told you! Yep! Yeah, all the way through! He's dead! He's dead! Dig him all! Roll it in! The walk into his dead! Told you exactly what he was gonna do! Easily gets out! Oh. Oh, oh shit! And then trips on a gerbil! The only thing stop Oh! <laughs> <What>? <laughs> <laughs> oh, this game is going so fucking wrong on so many ways. On just levels of wrongness there. Oh, and he trips and he Bob fails. And weave, you, oh, it, you don't need the bob and weave. The, it, the body was right there. It's dead. He's bereft of life and he's KO'd. But I told you, that is exactly what the luggage was looking for. The orcs completely muck that one up. And suddenly they're back in business. However, a double gerbil, and next thing you know, BANG! And there goes yet another Saurus off the pitch. We are just racking them up like MMs. Go, man, go! That is the third heavy takedown of a Saurus there. And that one, he can't apothecary. The apothecary is indeed gone. Turn three! Orcs absolutely stuck in their dunny like M&M's here. They are acting like Millwall, macking away here. And they're just like making him make him like West Ham. Well, he's got the calico again. Easily picks up the ball here. It's funny how little the rerolls are getting used at this point. It's just absolute power ball. I <laughs> shoo! Yeah, I'm allergic to- oh, we, oh, we can sense it, we're allergic to the pain here, here we go, here comes the pain! Oh god, it's this lad! There's the pal, there's the takedown, did he get him? No, earlier stun, earlier stun! This might be the only thing saving the orcs here, they've only got one dead! One! And you fight! Damn, I'm good! Double fails the dodge, down he goes, down he goes, yeah, two and a one, well that will ruin your day, one in nine. <laughs> Casual, wasn't it there? Orcs, guess what, it's turn four, it is. I knew today was going to be special. Uh, feels that way, doesn't it, but that blitz is dead, and remember they are going to suffer an ejection later on with Bromma Dribble Snot, so... This is going to be an awkward game, isn't it? They're going to run out of players really quick at this point here. All right, well, there he goes. He realizes scoring. That's a great idea. See if you can get one of them dawn touchdown things. Yep, it's like the old playbook says. See if you've got the ball. He's got the ball, all right. It's not ahead. That's rolling around over here somewhere. But that is the whole idea. Give me some slugs. I'm going back in. Meanwhile, luggage. Now, this is not a foreign situation here. For this lizard team. Oh, fails the shadow. That would have been huge at this point here. And it allows him to re-maneuver into a better position. 
that was huge, because that's movement seven versus movement six, and he fails the shadow. That's rare, lads. That indeed is rare. And there's another one in nine. Oh, hell no. And down he goes. Down he goes. We say one in nine. Technically, there's a tackle on there. But, you know what? Same result in the end. He's down. 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 All right, orcs. Let's see what you can do here. Can you make this a little more orky, this game? Asking for the fans here. Well, they are working. They are moving around here. Rolling, rolling, rolling. He's got things all nicely marked here. More orcs moving in. Here we go. Strength 5 Black Orc here. He's the thumpy one. Slams it in. Going after another skink. And again, he can't break the armor. Almost got me that time. Hey, let me show you how it's done. Well, the orcs still aren't losing sight of what they need to do here. Score. And again, that is not exactly the smartest place to be here. We will see. Do the luggage once again take advantage of it? Now remember, the injured player's the break tackle one for the Sauruses. But remember, who else has break tackle? That little bastard. Yep, Sam, uh, you know, Samsonite indeed he is. And the lizards get right back to work. Oh, did he just get another one? Well, it's only a stun there. It's only a stun. Oh, look, a dodge worked. Yay! A dodge finally worked. There we go. Once again, break tackle. Here he comes. Going to slam away and try and peel away some orcs. Push me, push you. Doesn't exactly work the way you wanted it there. Meanwhile, let's try to save a skink. Holy dooly. And again, fails the dodge. And he's stunned again. Bang, 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 bang. You know, you normally would say this is going all bad at this point here for the luggage. But remember the last game this luggage team was in. They found a way. He's just got to be patient. And meanwhile here, Orcs being very aware how, well, quite frankly, that this should be a 1-0 game if it hadn't been for a journal. Are not letting up on this one here. They've learnt their lesson. They hope. Push me, push you here. All right, well, he's going for the cheeky surf. Yeah, I don't blame you, lad. There we go. Three dice. Bye. Bye. Into the crowd he goes. I'm moving already. Yeah, well, you might be moving, but it's only a KO, and that can always come back to haunt you later there. Maybe. Well, right now, that is a nice little cathedral there of luggage. You must be in Atlanta, Georgia. Atlanta, Georgia. Yeah. Where the luggage is nervous. <laughs> Tell me about it. True story, that. True story. And that was turn six there for the Orcs. It's not going too bad at all here. Oh, boss. Except for the death. The death really wasn't good. Now, let's take a quick little look here. As you can see, they still have their apothecary. They may need that. Another solid hit there. Takes them down. Oh, no. Yeah, here he comes. Hot Pursuit makes the bright tackle. And he's managed to mark the ball carrier. This luggage firm's amazing, isn't it there? This is why you love this coach. Never fucking gives up. Ever. Cordy could put on a clinic there, you know? And it's not Guinness, so that's saying something. You know, man, here we go. Over the top there, yep. Former world champion. Boy, he can show you what luggage can do. Well, you're getting the second one here. Is this the second coming of Guinness? I don't have any. I'm sorry. <laughs> It's all gone in my belly. Oh, no, more's the pity. There we go. Thanks for standing still, wanker. Took him down. Run and shoot. Shoot and run. Oh, that is a huge KO at this point here. Yeah, a huge KO. And you can see the old coach is delighted with how that turned out. He'll take a KO. He will 100% take a KO at this point here. Another big boy. Oh, oh, ow! That's Grot's work, that is. And there goes another skinky is gone. Permanent injury. AV decrease there. Oh, this is getting nasty. Dance, 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 dance. Oh, yeah, it's definitely a time to dance there. Ew, who knocked down my screen? Oh, dear. All right, I'll have to put that back later on. All right, here we go, over the top. Push me, push you there. Now nope, that failed. And there we go. Turn seven for the luggage. Can the luggage get the score? Big hit. Big knockdown right there. 
I'll probably put that back over at halftime. All right, here we go. Another solid hit. Frenzy takes him down. There's the pylon. Did he? No. Still can't break that bloody armor. He's trying. He's trying. All right. And meanwhile, Skink running in. Power of Shadow. Can't pursue. And he makes another dodge. Power of Shadow again. Still after him. Come here. Got him. Damn, son. Where'd you find me? And he's re-rolling it. Ah, that didn't work. <laughs> that didn't work at all. Not at all. Not at all, not at all, not at all. And the Orcs are just going to score that in. Up 1-0. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, definitely all the way to infinity there. Oh, this is becoming a weird day of just epic malfunctions, I swear. Must be orcs playing today. It must be orcs. Yeah, it must be the orcs. All right, there we go. Fine. Just fine. How are you? Orcs are up 1-0. to nil. Finally. But boy, did that take some solid work here. Bloody awful. Match number two of the final eight there. Good God. Well, most of the Cathedral woke up. And Rimmick doesn't have booze there, but most of his Cathedral woke up. But notice here. Cupheads. The Apothecary's gone. They had to Apothecary because they couldn't afford to lose this many sources so fast. However, well, they're already out of skink. They're out the break tackle Saurus now. He's done. Luggage have got themselves a problem. And they're, of course, the 1KO. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. They're down to 11, lads. However, the Orcs, well, they still have one reserve, but they haven't dead on their team. And now and it's time for a gentle gust of wind. Of course it is. So even definitely malfunctions can happen on this thing here. I had clips up there. I'm going to have to go talk to the fucking cat again. All right, luggage on their way, charging up here. They are trying to do a one-turn touchdown. They're actually going to try it. Let's see if this actually fucking works. Power of Frenzy. Oh, well, it didn't quite work the way he wanted. Bang, 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 bang. Oh, well, knocks him over, tries to kill him. Yeah, you can tell that didn't work the way he planned on. He had a great idea. He had a great idea. It didn't work. All right, easy peasy, happy squeezy. He's got the calico there. It's time for the easy cheese pleasion, so to speak. He got it. Fortune doesn't favor fools. And meanwhile here, the luggage, it's, they got nothing better to do here but stand firm and try and scrum it up here. And they really need a removal. Mess, and that is it for the half there. That is it for the half. Well, there's your halftime score. Finally, we got to the halftime. Yeah, we are all 1-0 to nil here. Just to remind you, this halftime, of course, is being brought to you here once again by Vegasmite here. It's concentrated beast extract to make them tougher. Vegasmite. You can tell what kind of day this is already becoming here. So who's actually winning this game here? Well, right now, the Orcs are holding firm. Best they can. Bomber Dribble Snot has indeed come on the field. The star has arrived. Let's hope that's not a fucking disaster. In me. Well, that's the luggage. Well, the KO stayed out there. So it's still 11 on 11. Orcs up 1 0. Reminder here Squeak Sandwich. There's no rock, no get the ref there. Well, we've already had one. You missed out on that, lad. We're on game two. Well, it's true. It is. Christ. Ooh. That's a freebie. Alright, the way today's going already here. Alright. 
I'm just gonna refill that one up. Excuse me, my lads. Why are they sitting up? Ugh, God, I need whiskey today. Scotch. Everything else I can think of there. Just today, unfortunately, it's more that bloody fireball whiskey. All right, so, luggage. We've seen how this team has run all season there. They're the ones that did the phenomenal comeback and fought it out against the... <coughs> Turfs team. And that firm suffered a horrible fight, even though they were up four players with five, six turns to score. Never gave up, never surrendered. And now let's see what happens here. Oh, yeah, it's the most exciting event you could possibly have. It is, of course, the crickets. What else would it be? All right, let's see what the luggage can do here. Oh, that is a hell of a kick there. That will indeed buy a little time here for the Orc Firm. Orc Firm? Will 1 0 hold? They really don't want this to go to overtime. You really don't here. If there's one to... Oh, here we go again. Brutality. Is he dead? No, nothing. He's been doing this all fucking day here. First half, nothing. Second half, still nothing. There's the double skulls. He goes after Bomber, takes him down, but it's only a stun. He's just, he doesn't want to risk Bomber. Bomber's probably the one player who can utterly fuck him up. Utterly fuck him up. Well, so can the rest of the team, but Bomber? He just saw a goblin. Ah, he was taking him down. Unfortunately, Bomber does survive. But that means that's two turns, no hand grenades. Remember, if you throw a hand grenade, you can't fucking move. Which a bunch of us have said is really fucking shy. Because it really limits the use, doesn't it, there? Alright, luggage. Well, I need to score this quick. And he's got the calico there. Moves up. And he's basically done that turn. Nothing really exciting there. Get out! <laughs> That's what it sounds like anyway here. Yeah. Alright, now it's time. See if the orcs can really make a bit of a difference here. <laughs> oh, double skulls! Immediately fails his first attack here of the second half. Has to re-roll that because he doesn't want to end the turn that quickly. He can't risk it. Because he knows what happens. The will just take off and then stall it out and then try and force an overtime. And we have seen this luggage team loves defense. It utterly adores being on the defense. Push me, push you. Solid uh, push into the group there. And now we've got one hell of a dunny going on here. Well, normally I would say if you orcs, you love this scrum. You have gotten rid of some pretty key players there. However, remember there's no tomorrow otherwise there. Here we go, big solid frenzy. Try it again! Did you get him? Nope, still can't fucking break the armor. He just cannot. He'll just keep trying, though. Bless his heart, he never quits. He's he's just inspired by his coach. Never quit. Keep going. <laughs> oh, you got to love these lads. All right, dodges away here. And he's going to keep waiting there. Meanwhile, rest the sources is. You're starting to th see the thinking here of the luggage. They're realizing, you know, the Orcs are going to do their best to just stand the line. And this is what this one free safety with tackle is for. That's what he's for. Any skink comes through here, bang! That's his job. Push me, push you here. Now you're so... And you failed. Why is he dodging? Why is he dodging? He's AG1. He's not going to succeed. Oh, sigh. Boy, that would have been poetic there if he'd actually broken his fucking armor. Oh, well, maybe a misclick. That happens at this high level of pressure there. And the Orcs storm in here. Oh, yeah, they think that was a huge mistake, and they're going to take advantage of it here. Storming in, and instead of... Oh, second double skulls of the second half. Immediately, there goes yet another reroll. Gets the takedown. Like shooting squigs in a barrel. Well, they have the squigs and you're not shooting them, so they're definitely not in the barrel. Oh, really? He's got the best shooters there is. Well, he didn't get called for it, so yep, Dribble did something. Didn't do anything really, but he did something then. I'll give him credit for trying. Push me, push you here, luggage. What a dunny this is. You can see it. This is a screen of orcs. 
But the problem is the Calico is back here and he at any time can get two or three players clear and just go. And that's basically what he's trying to do here. Luggage again. Just Like I said, you're seeing his thinking. He's keeping this open as a bailout plan. Either way, he can really do it there. But he wants to burn a couple of turns out. He is thinking overtime. Especially now that the rerolls are running out. Two red dice on the front line against Bobber. Takes him down. Goodbye. Finish her. And now the pylon. Did he finally get him? Yes! Hope you die from hugs. Killer hugs for everyone. Oh, that's killer hugs, all right. That is killer hugs there. Celebrate. Oh, Bomber. Fortunately, that's not permanent. Yeah, those never stick. Oh, well, did a good job on there. Well, now Bomber hasn't achieved his objective. He was a perfect player for dealing with this. He's not in the field no more. They took care of him finally. Orc slam in here. Goes in. Gets a nice big solid hit. Nice takedown. And that is a KO there. His mum would be proud of. Absolutely would be proud of in there. Yeah, or coach screaming his approval from the sideline there. And now the rest of the lads all charging. Goes to his corner. Just going to slam over here. Now well, he's just going to mark him for now. Meanwhile, Ripper, who's really not done much this game. Big hit. Big stand firm here. And now Ripper's realized he's got one job. One. We'll see how well he actually does it there. Turn 12 here for the Copperheads here. Luggage just watching the town's kick. And now they're realizing, well, time to go. And there he goes. Run, you little bastard. Run. Witness your doom! Well, uh, uh, he's right. It's time to go. And there he goes, running for his life here. Meanwhile, does he go for the break tackle? Yes, he does. Once again, busting out. Uh. Who we'll called the cops? Yeah, that is kind of the problem there. Remember, bright tackle. He's strength five. AG5 never fails. <laughs> Famous last words. Solid block, solid time. Oh, did he get him? Kill him, do it. Shoot him. No, it's an orc this time. Doesn't work. Well, he's back to his usual routine of fail. Well, he got one. And I gotta admit, that was a good one to get there, Bomber Dribble Snot. That was a lot, good lad to take out of the game. Another big push me, push you there. And here he comes, charging in. Gets the block. Big solid takedown. Cat cracked the armor, though. That's what I wanted to hear. Not really. Well, he marked him. Remember, AG4. Remember, the Chorps had this problem. AG4 on the sideline. Now, the Orcs are doing it smarter. They just, they're really marking him up solid this time. But they don't have a tackle. They don't have a player in front here. So it might not work either. Where's he going? That's going to be the big question. Where's the tackle going? Is he going to go in here? That's not good enough. That's not good enough by far. Ah, I'm mocking. No, you need to be here or here especially. That's wrong. Oh, dear. Lesson still not learned, apparently. And there he goes. Easy. Dodge away. There he goes. Is he going to score? No, not yet. But he's on his way. Get out. Yeah, yeah. He's on his way. All right. And meanwhile, luggage getting re uh, readjusted here. They, they don't mind another turn or two burning out. Makes another bright tackle. Well, there's the power of shadowing. It works again. And meanwhile, there we go. Solid push me, push you. And that wasn't the plan. That wasn't the plan at all. However, it does free him up. See what he did there? Nicely thought out there. Nicely thought out. Meanwhile, more dodge, more slotty, and then he fails that one. I'm surrounded by idiots. And there's a KO. Of course it is. Oh, well. Oh, dearie, dearie. Well, at least he's not dead. Yet. There's still plenty of game to go there. Whew. Well, this is going to be a hell of a game, isn't it, there? All right. Let's turn it back to the Orcs. Like I said, Orcs, that was a misplay. That was a misplay. They still haven't learned about this AG4 loud, have they? They still haven't figured them out. Chorps made this mistake, and now the Orcs, unfortunately, have doubled down on that mistake. Well, stand firm, and now they've got problems. And block on block. No, block me, block you. And nothing's going anywhere. Meanwhile, down the field, Mr. Strength 5 punching away. Well, he's punching over his weight class. 
All right, well, looks like he's going to have to give the touchdown up. Charges it. Gets a nice block. Big hit, big takedown. It's all yours, boss. But now he still has to go and tag this up just to force a die roll. Another big hit down the field here. Two dice. Push me, push you here. Well, one, two, three, four, five, and a go. Well, Orcs have got no choice, do they? Here we go. Well, he got him marked. Now he's just hoping and praying for a 1 in 36. That's really all he's waiting on. And there it was. Double skull on the first block. But then he re-rolls it there because it's a block. Whew, talk about timing on dice. Makes the dodge, runs across. There's the score. And we're tied at 1. Woohoo! was a lot of work for one touchdown. An awful lot of work. Worth it, though. Let's turn this one now back around here. Now you're starting to see the orc problem. There's no one left. They're down to the solo level. Left. And the KO continues. Okay, it's a different one this time. But you know what I mean. So we are 11 on 11. Are we looking at overtime? Now, let's be honest. If you're the Orcs, do you want to get an overtime? Not in the slightest do you want to get an overtime. If, you're, 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 if it happens, it happens. But you don't want to go there. If you're the luggage, do you want to go to overtime? Maybe. Because you definitely have a team that is very easy. Bill Bexley Speed can easily recover the Calico and score. If you win the toss and you're on the offense, I don't think the Orcs are stopping you, son. I don't think they're stopping you. So it really now is going to come down to the Orcs here. The Orcs, three turns, need to slam in, find a way, and try and score here. And of course, the free reroll there for the Lizards of all things. That's just perfect. Stupid idiot. <laughs> it is. Oh. But they do have the fame. So that's really no surprise here. Oh, oh, that's a perfect kick into the backside. There we go. Solid punch. Can't even break your block. Mighty blow. I be nothing. How about you? Yes! Yeah, he's dead! He's dead! Dig him out! Roll him in the Gucci! Ambag's dead! Well, at least we finally have a kill there to the other side. That's the start! It really is! If you're the Orcs, you needed that! There we go, another solid hit here, but... The two stuns and a death! Yeah, they'll take it! Not that he has any choice there, does he? He'll take it like a fucking old of the shins, won't he? Alright. Moving right along here. Orcs. Pressing and pressing hard. Oh, look at this here. Subtle, isn't it? Going right after Mr. Superstar. Takes him down. Kill him. Do it. Shoot him. Nope. Can't break his armor. However, he fails picking up the calico. Why are we re-rolling? Here's why. Because if it goes out... I guarantee you the Lizards are getting that one. That's why he has to re-roll that one. He's got no choice. He, he, normally I would say don't re-roll it. He's got no fucking choice. He cannot risk it bouncing out. That's a hell of a decision tree, isn't it there? Crap, crap, shit, fuck. I really, really think that sucks. Does indeed, but you really got to feel for the old coach on that one. Normally, I'd say it's a bad reroll, but he's got no choice. He's got to reroll that one on a failed pickup because it's in the end zone. He can't let it bounce out. If it does, luggage wins. It, it hands down the luggage wins. You guarantee they're after that calico like that. Luggage, quickly go and read just here. Light screen. 
And all they gotta do is buy time. They are trying to force this to go into the overtime. As you can see, there, ball all the fucking way back there. Orcs, no rerolls left. Iron Man! Big block, big... Ah, they get something nice. Sure, we'll take it. But when do we get to shoot something? Well, they definitely shot that thing. Gucci handbag is gone once again. Yorick, very proud of that one there, as is the Orc coach. And that is now two good solid removals there by the Orcs. Maybe, maybe, but you've watched this, lu this luggage firm. Not giving it away, but you saw it last time. They've been down players before. Nothing shakes this coach. He just goes, right, do this then. You think he, you think he coached for Chelsea? Oh, no. We gotta shoot some stuff up, yeah? And you see what the Orcs were doing there. They're trying to get an eligible receiver down the field for the hell miracle play. They tried. They really fucking tried. <sighs> I tell you, that perfect kick's really starting to kick them in the gonads now, isn't it? Well, the Orcs are going to have to do it with their teammate. You're right. It's the only other option they got. They don't want it, but it's the only thing they've got. Will the luggage spot it, though? They might not see this. Charges in. Oh, he's got him marked, all right. Oh, he's putting everybody in. This is going to be fun. There we go. Solid hit. Solid takedown on the sideline there. There goes the Orc alignment. Bye. <laughs> Not long for this life. Meanwhile, Cheeky is. As Cheeky does. Here we go. Two more dice. Slams it in. Push me, push you. Well, takes him down, actually. And marks the poor Garbo. Well, who said Orcs lies were easy? Well, we'll see if he actually makes it. God, so many dice this is going to take. Well, it's like Jervis always tells me. It's a dice game. You never fucking know. Well, he's trying to clear him away from the ball carrier. All right, that's fair. Gets the blitz. Gets the push away here. One die here. He'll take it. It's a push away. Now the tough one. He needs to get rid of this lad. Two dice. Gets the takedown. He removes the problem. Well, he's done the job. He's done the job indeed. Mine's shootier than yours. Now he has to do the handoff. Here we go. Hand off the goblin. He got it. Got it, boss. Dun, 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 dun. There's the throw. <sighs> Why don't they die? <sighs> Buzz this much. By this much, yep, by that much. Out of town, Booth cannot believe it. We are going into overtime. 50-50 on the landing. Fail. I miss when you can actually row an accurate throw and get plus one. I fucking miss that. I really do. Dun 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 who won the toss? It's your worst fucking nightmare. It's your worst fucking nightmare. The luggage won the toss. The luggage won the toss. See, this is what I was just talking about, and the Orcs knew it. They knew this was coming. They lost the toss. Now, mainly the Orcs still have a full firm of 11 players. Luggage no longer have that luxury. They are down. A good solid injuries there. So you can see the count right there. They are down to 10. But this luggage firm, not the first time he's been down players and has to figure out a way to win the bloody game. So he's right where he wants them. And notice the difference here. One reroll. The luggage have one. As for the Orcs, God, they would have loved to have had that reroll back. But again, that wasn't a bad reroll. He couldn't risk it bouncing out on the failed pickoff. Zero risk. He's not wrong. It's a hell of a gamble. He had to take the reroll. He had to use it then. Boy, did he ever wish he could have had that fucking back now. But I don't think it's the wrong decision at all. It was the best decision he could make there. Hello, cold. Welcome home. Oh, no. And the luggage get themselves another convenient reroll. Now, merely the ball's all the way in her backside there, but I don't think they care. There we go. It's a nice little solid stun right there. Hey, that's pretty good. And maybe another block. Big takedown right there. 
And suddenly the Orcs are in trouble. They take two stuns early. So that's two players completely out of contention on this one here. Charges in. Can he make it three? There's the frenzy. Is he going to charge through? Is he going to... Oh, he thought about it. How indeed. He thought about it. He was thinking about it. But this is where it becomes the big and not so subtle difference between this coach and his previous opponent here. He's playing to fucking win. Nice hit right there. Oh, you can hear the scream from there. And Ripper is out of the game. Ripper is out. I say again, Ripper is out. Boy, what a fucking waste of money he was there. That is huge. That is a nasty KO to happen at this point of the game here. And the luggage easily pick up the calico here and start marching up the field here. Boy, it's goblins on rollerblades, lads. Dirty player, streams on in. Doesn't have to foul. It's not urgent at this point here. He's actually got what he needs now. He's got the he's got the poor orcs on their back heels. Can attack right here. He's going after the quick skink. He's hoping to get him there. Got him! He's got the best shooters there is. It's only a KO. You 100% take it at this point. You do not argue that you just got a removal. It is a nice solid hit there. And a big huge cheer. Yay. <laughs> uh, about as huge as he can get here today there. All right, revancing back down the field. Full speed ahead here by the Orcs. Orcs desperate to stop this year. They're not even too sure if they want this to go to kickoffs as long as the rerolls are still in play. Goblins, as you can see, yeah. He's got a gob. He's a blodger. He's a superstar. Shame he didn't fucking land. Ugh, sigh. Luggage get right back to work here. Kill him. Do it. Shoot him. Stand firm. Fall fuck down. And meanwhile, Luggage just continue to scrum this one up here, letting the clock tick away here. Ah, oh, here we go. This is the most terrifying blitz there. Push me, push you. Sorry, it's not the pro that. He could have. He didn't. That's his choice. Might be getting either. Well, that's fine. That's fine. He's happy with the push in this case. And meanwhile, here he comes. Zoom, zoom, motherfucker. The full speed ahead down the field there. Moving like he's Birmingham. And you, clearly not there. All right. Back to Orcs here. Orcs. Boy, this slimmest margin's hanging on here. It is 1-1. One, one. This has been a battle royale here. Ripper being out of the game, though, has certainly crippled the Orcs' chances at this point here, but they're going to keep on fighting. Free safety with tackle, staying in the back there. Solid hit, solid tank down. Orcs moving back here. They don't like staying on the front line, hoping to get another good key skink removal here. Side step. How about die, die, die? Yeah. We've been waiting. Yeah, he's been waiting a while there. He will take that casually there, and he'll swallow it, and he'll say, mm, 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 them is good eating. Over here, push me, push you here. Orcs, they're keeping this game to the wheel. They're keeping it to the wheel. Makes the dodge away from the prehensile tail. I'm alive! Yo, oh, you better hope you're alive. And meanwhile, the free safety continues waiting for the, the lizard that might be coming any minute now over the top. Or under the bully. Oh, no, it could be either at this point here. And here comes Mr. Dynamite here. The crooks, he has had a phenomenal season. Slams away, gets the takedown, moves here, because he knows this goblin's a major threat. He is! Meanwhile, another solid pow, solid takedown, knocks him over. Here we go. No, not piling on. Interesting. You can really see the gears running in the uh, lizard coach. Oh, now he's got it. He's in scoring position with two rerolls there. Runs over here just to piss the fucker off. And then he fails that one. Ooh, that's gonna hurt. And he's going to reroll it because why not? That's why not. Uh. Overtime. Our crooks with blocking pro. Yep, you're seeing it. Have you seen what I just saw? And you can see the luggage were really trying to rub that one in. Well, this is the only player that can honestly save the situation. And he's going to have to slam in here. One, two, three, four. Yeah, this is it. 
And he doesn't do the blitz. He's going to have to come up with something else then. He's going to risk it here. Makes the dodge. Remember, he's got no rerolls left. Crashes in. We is the shootiest. That was the play there, gents. And the gerbils win again. Sigh. All right. Well, don't worry. We saw that in the other game there. Nuffle could go both ways at this point here. Luggage. Push me. Push you here. Bouncing down the field. Slow but steady. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two GFIs. He's got one reroll left here. Is he going to go for the score? AG4. Beautifully in. Makes one GFI. Does he want to put away? Yes, he does. It's in. That is it, lads. Two to one. And that indeed is it there. What a game. All the way to overtime. Both coaches giving everything they've got in a bag of chips. What was that crisps? I don't know. It really depends where they're from on the pond, doesn't it? Yeah. Two to one though is your final score. The Copperhead Cinderella Sorry continues. They are on to the final four. As for Black Gulf Booty Smashes, the walk is over. They are going home there. That is it for bloody awful today there, because we're still waiting on the other two games. That's fine. They've got a bit of the week to get those over with there. And so that means we're done for Sunday. Bloody awful Sunday there. So, thank you all for tuning in today. Really, we need another game there, do we? Fair! Right, another game. Cheers! Stay tuned. We're coming in with AD Invitational. We'll be back shortly. And Nuffle, bless your dice.